Okay, so welcome back, and here we are in Canada. The land of cans. That's not quite what Canada is, but sure, we'll go with that. Okay, so it looks like there's a lot of things around here. Whether we can... Oh, what well, we can actually get on a boat. Huh. Alright, well, cool. That was so worth to get this little one chest. The one chest. Alrighty. How do we fight these guys? There you go. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Alright. Oh no, I was gonna upgrade, but I was gonna put a weapon add on to make my weapon a bit stronger so I could actually kill people, wasn't I? Damn, fool. Oh well, we'll do it next time. We'll do it after this battle. Remind me. Shout at me. Scream at me. You know, all that good stuff. Right, blow this guy up. Bam. Die wolf down. That actually hit me. What? Apparently it hit me. That's really annoying. Die wolf's dead. I've got bigger things to deal with. Very nice. I'm pretty sure I have a better ranged weapon I can use. I should have a look. It's very important that they do hit all of them in a row, because that's going to be my tactic for taking them out, I guess. Yeah, I do have better ones. Bounces on nine targets as long as three remain. So that's pretty much... That does the same thing, just does more damage. That's pretty good. Um, that's just a normal bow. Not very useful. It's good for hitting one target, but we kind of want to use it as a kind of ability to clear. So let's use the super bouncy ball. And we want to upgrade it so it does more damage. That should do it nicely. That should just be enough. It of course doesn't add bleed, so it may actually be worse, but we'll see. Because the bleed does a heck ton of damage, I'm not going to lie. Okay, cool. So let's, let's head to the Winnipeg or whatever. Where Count Dracula is waiting for us. Count someone, I can't remember the name. Come at me, bruh. Come at me, bruh. Yeah, that does a bit more damage, I think. And then, of course, Cartman can... So our tactic is going to be the same thing pretty much every fight. These die wolves die fairly easily if you do this. That die wolf didn't die. Wow. Uh -huh. I gotta go! Oh, Cartman got hit, apparently. Alright, die wolf down. Yeah, 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 yeah. You guys lose. yeah, you do. Cartman's fire attack is too OP. Alright, let's go. I assume this is where we want to be, but I may be wrong. Welcome to, Win Welcome to Winnipeg. This is a conservative township, so mind your P's and Q's. Lumberjack is dangerous work. T's and but with all these diapers, man. Nice. I don't know what this guy said. He said something. Welcome to Winnipeg. This is a conservative township, so mind your P's and Q's. Do whatever you want with your T's and M's, however. I see. Welcome to the shop. Can I interest you in my wares? There's no one here. What? Sure, we'll buy your weapon. We're actually almost out of money. How crazy. Welcome to the shop. There's no one here. What the heck? <laughs> Who are we talking to? The Canadian Invisible Man. You know what Winnipeg is known for? Uh, neither do we. They say that two Canadian monks live on a secluded island in the middle of Vancouver. Welcome to the shop. Can I interest you in my wares? Are you serious? What? This poor citizen was killed dire, by a dire, dire bear. But there's dire bears up you there. You know what a dire bear is, right? You know what a dire bear it's is, like right? Bear, but it's dire. This poor citizen was killed by a dire bear. You know what a dire bear is, right? It's like a bear. <laughs> they all say the same thing. So dire wolves are like wolves, but dire. Dire bears are like bears. But dire. Whew. Pretty, pretty damn sad. Ah, yes. This writing is definitely Canadian. But why should I help a foreigner when Winnipeg is completely overrun with dire bears? Tell you what. Kill off all the dire bears in the north of town, and I'll help you however I can. Alrighty, I guess we're fighting dire bears now. Hopefully it'll be okay. I don't know. Fingers crossed. There's only one, luckily. Oh, no. I let him attack me first. Oh, oh geez. This I'm going to die. We fought enough guys already. Oh, dude, that hurt. Alright, Carmen's dead if this one attacks him. Wow. They all focused Cartman. Wow. I am sorry, dude, but we will revive you with this lovely revive potion, which do we even have one? We do. I think this will give him full health. Because I think we did it. Yes. That's pretty damn useful. Right, let's stun one of them, because that will that will at least reduce the damage that he takes. Of course, you can't actually see what's going on, but you can luckily hear the sound. Otherwise, we would be a bit screwed. Alright, Cartman, burn them. Burn them all. They're not actually weak to fire, so maybe that's not a good idea. Throwing a tampon at them, though, that is a, the best idea we can possibly have. Lightning bolt. 
year. Okay, so apparently they're not weak to fire, but fire does hit them all, so I guess we continue with that kind of trend. Oh, there you go, they're on fire now. Oh, we're on fire as well. Whatever, dude. Never fart on someone's balls. That is the one thing you must learn. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Hopefully Cartman can now finish them off with his explosive cloud of death. Yes, he can! Very nice. Alright, those die bears weren't too tough. God. Cartman is definitely God. Level 15, though. Gaining some pretty good levels around here. Are these human skulls? Are you serious? Wow. We got a quest pelt. A quest item, a bear pelt. Okay. Alright then. You did it. What are you gonna say? This poor citizen was killed by a dire bear. A what? You know what a dire bear is, right? It's like a bear, but it's dire. Did I only get two of them? By Jove, you no, no, I did it. Okay. Look at all these dire bear pelts. Now I can finally make a dire row. Alright, give me that document. Yes. This is actually written in the language of Eastern Canadian. The Minister of Montreal can translate it. But I'm afraid the Prince has imprisoned the Minister of Montreal in the caverns of Quebec. I will speak with the Prince. Return to him and he should let you speak with the Minister. Boy, oh boy. I will have the most dire robe in all of Canada. Cool. Oh, we got a new friend. And that must be Canadian. So we're going back to the Prince. Okay, then we can do that. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. All right, Prince, we're here for you. We've come to talk to you. We need a word with you, Prince. Fists clenched. Okay, let's go, 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 go. There you are. I understand you wish me to release the Minister of Montreal. I'd like to help you, but I think this might be another ploy by the Bishop of Banff to have Montreal allowed back into the kingdom. Some Canadians think our nation should be united again, my lord. Kill this guy. <laughs> Shut up! Who the fuck are you? Listen, it's all because the Bishop of Banff is a liberal. He does these things just to make life difficult for me. I must ask you to perform another noble quest. Go to Banff and kill the Bishop. <gasps> kill the Bishop of Banff? Shh, you, shh. Kill the Bishop of Banff for me and bring me his balls as proof. Do this and I shall allow you into the catacombs of Quebec. Make haste! Alright, we need to go kill someone and take his balls. Sounds pretty South Park-esque. Fine by me, I guess. Can we get new photos? You already got your photos. Go on, get out. Okay, apparently we're not allowed more photos. Damn, I just wanted some photos. Ottawa is the capital of all Canada. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. All right, time to leave. I don't actually know my Canadian geography, so... All right, time to take out the snake. Come at me, bruh. I do know Vancouver, though. Vancouver is a place I have heard of. Simply because they held the Winter Olympics there at some point, didn't they? I hope they did, because that's where I think I've heard it from. Fart attack, fart attack, friendly neighbors, fart attack. That did a lot of damage. Oh boy. I got dire AIDS, oh no. Don't know what that means. Have I got AIDS? I've got bigger things to deal with. I actually did get AIDS. Alright, that's what Dude, the you got dire AIDS. What does that mean? Alright, let's go back and get our AIDS cured, I guess. I don't know what di- it's, it's, It is a reference to South Park episode. Oh boy. Ah! That bear almost got me, but didn't quite. All right, we need to get our age checked. I see you. You are now cured of dire AIDS. You still have it. You still have AIDS, just not dire. That's okay. Dire AIDS has been cured. Screw you. All right, should we check out the other towns? Let's check out Banif. All right, hey. Have you been to Newfoundland? You won't find better sodomy in all of Canada. Welcome Sodomy. to the shop. Can I interest you in my wares? Right, this guy at least talks. Can't afford the knife. All any of this stuff. Damn. Where do I get more Canadian Grabs money? Are tough, sure. But if you ask me, the deadliest catch is man. Ah, it's very noble. Look at the bishop. Praise Christ. Praise God. Praise God and Christ. I think I have to kill you. The prince thinks Canada is a monarchy. But there's a... What's this? Who the fuck hits a bishop? Alright, time to kill him. Assassin! Assassino! That's us. 22,000 health. He almost definitely cannot be stunned. Yep, he's immune. And he still has USB drive though. What kind of bishop has a USB drive anyway? Throw a magic missile at him. 
takes damage. And he gets grossed out. I didn't expect him to be able to get grossed out. Okay, then. All right, here we go. The most powerful move in Cartman's arsenal. Wiener, the curse. Weirdo. I hope you fucking shut up. Skank. Ginger. The Janet. Dumb Dumb. Not getting too. Oh, oh, Holy hell, that did a lot of damage. Oh, he healed himself. What a bellend. Why did he heal himself? What? Alright, backstab his ass. I probably could have just League of Assassin him or whatever it's called. It probably would have done equal amounts of damage, to be honest. Alright, we're going for it again. Dildo, hot, piece of crap, lame-o. Ah, bash the button! Wow. He's going to heal himself again, isn't he? No, he's not. Okay, well, he's going to die. We, uh... Well, well, that was an easy fight. I feel like these fights have got progressively easier. Simply because we're ridiculously powerful at the moment. Okay, okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, you don't have to kill me. I'll go away and the prince will never know I'm alive. Please, take these dire pig testicles and tell the prince they're mine. Uh, okay. Bless you, my son. It'll be our secret. Wow, good thing I saved these. Ah, uh, come on, dude. We should take his bars anyway, so we have extra. Okay. Praise Christ. Praise God. Praise God. Praise Christ. Praise God. Praise God and Christ. He's not doing a very good job of hiding, though, is he? Mm. Oh, well, Most I didn't kill Canadians him. Canadians are quite religious. I didn't kill him or take his balls. I guess I'm not so violent. But there seems to be a, something hidden under this vase in here, so I'm going to go and hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Wow, oh, dude. Did it. Is that a press pad? Ah, cool. We can get the chest. Very, 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 very 8 esque Upgrade available. Oh, I forgot we were level 15. That means we have a new upgrade. Well, we'll do that at some point. Okay. We've got a discus of bleeding. Nice. I kind of want to go to Vancouver, but I assume they're going to make us go there anyway. I wonder if we can afford this guy's stuff. How, how much money do we have? One dollar. Okay, that's not really what we're looking for, so... Come on. I assume they make us go to Vancouver before we can go anywhere else, so... Vancouver it is. No, I mean, Ottawa it is, and then Vancouver. Alright, run, run, run! To the prince! Oh boy. Alright, here we go, prince time. What are you gonna say? Is he dead? Did you kill him? Yay, the bishop's bars! Now religion won't interfere with government. How can we ever repay you? You said you would free the minister of Montreal, my lord. Sorry, no can do. With both the bishop and the minister taken care of, my throne is secure. But my liege, we made a promise. Shh, you. Shh. Quickly, you must speak with the Duke of Vancouver. He can help you get into the catacombs of Quebec. Give the Duke this. Hurry now. All right, well, this person's definitely a traitor. Oh, we're now friends with the Prince of Canada on Facebook. Nice. Tension in real life as well. I guess it kind of reflects it. I like how the whole game is pretty much about making friends on Facebook. Which is very much what real life was at some point, probably. Or well, people played life as a game and, you know, made friends. Vancouver it is! Hello, Vancouver. Many wonderful films are shot in Vancouver. All of them are about cabins terrorized by serial killers. Hockey is quickly becoming the world's 11th most popular sport! <laughs> okay. Now this, this sailing is slow as balls. Alright, what's going on in this house then? Oh, is it Ter this is Terrence and Phillips' house. They live in Quebec. Oh, bleh. Oh, yeah, Quebec. This is where we are. No, we're in Vancouver. They live in Vancouver. Interesting. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, another shop. Let's see if they have anything for sale. Of course, People come from far and wide to buy our Welcome to the shop. Can I interest Canada. you in my wang? Plus, we can't afford anything, so... Archmage's one. Interesting. Unfortunately, like I said, we can't afford it, so... Damn. Welcome to Vancouver, the San Diego of Canada. Yes, indeed. Hello. They say that the Duke earned his title yes, by winning yes, a long ball with the... A letter from the princess? What the... Why, according to this, the prince had something to do with the bishop's murder and has imprisoned the minister unjustly. Young man, if you wish to brave the catacombs of Quebec, you would have to speak with the monks who live to the southeast of town. Only they could train you in such sorcery. Alright, so we're gonna go visit... The Duke of Vancouver is a very busy man. The monks, as in Terrace Philip. 100%. Calling it right now. Yes, we got a new weapon as well. What level was that weapon? I didn't actually check. Axe of Rending. Serrated Axe of Rending. It's not a, just an axe, it's a serrated axe. Fucking... Does that even work with an axe? Let's be honest here. An axe is for hacking and chopping and slicing. I guess... 
I don't know. Would you want a serrated axe? Well, it would be a... I guess it might work for killing people. If your axe gets stuck in flesh, you do more damage to them, but... It's not going to help you chop down trees, that's for sure. Terrence and Philip, help me out. Who are you? Perhaps he is the American everyone is talking about, Terrence. Nah, it can't be. He can't be a master of spellcraft. He doesn't even know magic. He probably doesn't even know how to fight. <laughs> I... I do. Sweet. <laughs> Uh, I, I hit Terence, but now I don't have to fill it. <laughs> he knows Dragon Shout. Any magician's apprentice can Dragon Shout. It's not like he wow. found it into his hand and hit you in the face with it, Philip. I guess we're cup of, cup of spell then. Gotta show these guys who's boss. <laughs> oh my god, he can cup a spell! If he's really good, how come he can't sneak a fart behind your fares? Alright, we got a sneaky fart as well. The sneaky squeaker! Very impressive. He is worthy of our training after all. Yes. Prepare thyself, child. It is time for you to learn some true magic. It's time for the real magic test, then. Your magic is impressive, young American. <laughs> Not since Eric von Thunderpants of Nova Scotia have we seen such prowess. But now, you must learn to control your anus muscles in just the right way to change a spell's frequency. Some objects seem too large to be damaged by magic, but now I will break through it with Nagasaki! Here, watch again! Now you try! Believe in yourself! So this is essentially the same as Dragon Shout, but it's called Nagasaki instead. I love how it's a rip off the Matrix though. These three pedophiles from Alberta will have their way with you unless you damage them all with one move. Nagasaki! <laughs> okay, gotta kill those pedophiles. I am! Nagasaki! <laughs> That's it! You have the power! You did it! Now go out and use your anus for the good of mankind! And don't ever, ever fart on a man's balls. We won't, don't worry guys. We won't. No farting on anyone's balls, everybody. That's rule number one of this game. But I've learned anything from playing South Park. Boy, I haven't learned anything. It's that you should never fart on another man's balls. What was my quest now, anyway? Pretty sure it's just recruit the girls. Oh, Canada. Go to the catacombs and use your new technique to break in. First, we take out the snakes, though. Hopefully, we don't get AIDS again. Uh -oh. There's a lot of them. Alright, Cartman, we need to do a lot of damage here. Do it, Dark Cartman, do it! It's not quite enough, apparently. At least he gave me AIDS. That's right, bitch. Cool, no AIDS, that's good. No AIDS today! See, new kid, that has done. Perfect. Oh no, I should pick up whatever this thing dropped. I got a dire heart, whatever that is. Alright. To the catacombs! She's being guarded by a dire bear, which is rather unfortunate. Never mind, we ran away. Screw you, dire bear! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Alright, so we want to Nagasaki into here. Help this guy escape. <laughs> well, how do we do this? <laughs> I think I need to be right up against it. Why is it not working? Come on. <laughs> oh, what the heck? There we go, okay. Nagasaki! <laughs> Pretty good. Alright, there's a lot of dire creatures here. Oh, we want to Nagasaki them before we get to them, I guess. Is that all you got, bruh? Alright, I guess we need to get closer. Ah! <laughs> oh boy! Oh, we're gonna die. I wanted to Nagasaki them! 
I think we might be dead, guys. Oh, 3,000! Are you serious? You think this is funny, you son of a bitch? Oh, boy. Oh, we get it. Like I thought. Alright, we definitely need to Nagasaki them. Oopsie daisy. I'll be have to do it again. Goodness, goodness sake. Alright, there we go then. Oh, not Nagasaki. What is this? Yeah, nicely done. Alright, how do I not get stuck with these guys then? Unless I can actually shoot the barrel behind them or something. Uh. Seriously though. <laughs> ah! Alright, okay, so we can... We can get to about here. We should be able to not get stuck in them from here, I think. Hmm. I can't seem to quite find the frequency though. <laughs> so we could try something else, I guess. We could try Sneaky Squeaker. <laughs> well, I made the glance. Man, I definitely feel like we need to Nagasaki them, but. How do I do? How do I do it? Ugh. Where is it? Where's the point? Uh, how do I? Oh my god. I don't really know. I haven't got any summons either. That would make life easier. Well, we're going to have to try it. This looks like a job for the Grand Wizard and his trusty sidekick. <laughs> Alright then. It's the mark of death, this guy. Oh, come on, I did that. Well, I can't even see him. Wow, I failed miserably. Alright, then come and do some work, because this is tough. Uh... I didn't kill any of them. Wow, that damage, that hurts. Oh, we killed the snake. One snake down. If we survive, then we might actually die. Oh, we got pwned. No way. No, 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 no! Oh my god, I just attacked him. Are you serious? Wow. Wow, we. Did not mean to do that. I pressed the button too quickly, apparently. Yeah, okay. Well, we have to Nagasaki this again. How the heck am I meant to get through here? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Okie dokie. How the heck do I... I clearly need to Nagasaki that barrel in the background, right? But how the heck do I do that? There is no right frequency at the moment. <laughs> Can I alien probe in? Can I gnome past them? No, oh, that didn't help. <laughs> thought it might, but no, that didn't help. Okay, uh, can we... Buddy command's not gonna help, shooting's not gonna help. Somehow separate them. Nope. All right, let's just try fighting them, I guess. You want to throw down, dog? I'll throw down. These guys certainly want to throw down. Let's try this one again, then I guess. No, that didn't go so well last time. It also does very little damage. I could stun one of them. Yeah, a lot of damage, but we need Cartman to do it a lot. Like, he needs to take out this dire bear. So that's what we're gonna do. Hopefully he can. 3,000 damage isn't 
outside of his range, so let's see what happens. Smash my crazy fool! Alright, one bear down. That's okay, that's pretty good. And if we can block every attack. Oh no. Oh boy, that is not what I said. I said block every attack, not get hit by. Oh, I'm dead. 100%. Yep, there you go. Oh boy, this is fun, isn't it? This is, this is what we want to see. Alright, one more try, I guess, and then we're call it a day. I was, I actually need to... Um... How do we Nagasaki these guys? Can we just, like, chase them around up here? And then run past them? That would be pretty nice. But honestly, like... Uh... Uh, one of the wolves didn't come. Is that a good sign or a bad sign? I don't know. Well, we're gonna try fighting them one more time. No, you both wanna throw down, there. Dog? I'll throw and, down. Uh, if this doesn't work, then I guess we'd find out, work out another way. I honestly don't know, to be honest. There's a lot of. It does come. If we if we shield everything, we will kill them. That is something I can say for sure. Hundred percent surety on that. It's not really necessary to to stun him and kill him on the same turn. He always can't attack while he's stunned, but we'll do it anyway. All right, get ready to block. I can't block all three. Have to do better than that. Tom is almost dead though. Oh boy. That is so much damage. Nice, nice blocking. We're alive. Everybody, yes, we're alive! Heal Cartman up a little bit. Okay. Now, bouncy ball, or I think we killed the bear. I think that is what we have to do right now. Hopefully. Uh, uh. Uh, the bear is dead, nice. Okay, Cartman, magic missile. No, no, he needs to heal. What am I saying? Heal time. Healy boy. Right, I don't know if that's even going to be enough health for him. Oh, he ate two. What a greedy bugger. Of course it's Carmen. What are they expecting, really? Right, I think this might actually take... Yeah, this will kill them. We're actually going to win the fight. Wow. What do you know? This we did it. Be a day for all to remember. I'm pretty sure you weren't meant to do it like that, though. I'm pretty sure that was a better way of doing that. But whatever, we did it. Well, maybe, maybe there wasn't. I don't know. That was a tough fight. That wasn't an easy fight by any means. Okay, I think, do we have everything? They're all kind of dead on top of each other, so it's hard to tell. <laughs> Very hard to tell. Oh well, okay. Let's talk to this guy. Je suis libre! Je suis libre! Oh. Ne vous besoin de collections traduit? Okay. Alright, now we're now a friend's friend with the princess in the Montreal. Did we get the translation? I guess we did. I guess we'll call it a day there. Thank you very much for joining me. We defeated this ridiculous horde. It took me a lot of attempts. That was the most I've actually died in this game. I don't know if that's because I was playing it badly or playing it wrong, but it worked out in the end. Thank you very much for joining me then. Until next time. Bye.